Well, there's an adaptive sport event at Woodward Park City this weekend that is likely to turn on wheelchair users to an exciting new world of activities. As new specialist Jed Bull shows us, it's a chance for wheelchair users and their families and friends to drop into a skate park just for the thrill of it. It's the third annual Wheelchair Palooza happening here at Woodward Park City Saturday from 4 o'clock to 8 o'clock. It's a chance for wheelchair users and their families to find out about the kind of excitement that they can have and the independence that they will develop just by dropping into a skate park. <laughs> it really helps them learn that they can do the things that they want to do. We caught up with Amanda King, the event organizer, and Kyle Marchant, a wheelchair MX rider, at the Lone Peak Skate Park in Sandy as they showed off some skills. It was definitely very scary at first, but the first time that I ever dropped into a skate park, it was the biggest adrenaline rush I've ever had in my life. Each of them started using a wheelchair as a kid due to disabilities they were born with. But it wasn't until they started exploring adaptive sports that they really discovered themselves. Kyle competes in competitions across the country. We're trying to show everyone that even though you're in a wheelchair, you can still do anybody that anybody else that is able-bodied can do. They're both air shocks. This is an actual skateboard wheel. From mountain biking and skateboarding to riding a custom wheelchair, even grinding on a rail. When you find a community that you can exist in and feel like yourself and have others that are like you, you're able to talk about more things and learn about things that you never knew before. King went to wheelchair camp as a six-year-old and discovered other kids just like her. She's been playing basketball, skiing, <laughs> and taking a few spills ever since. Everybody falls. But the more she lifted herself back up, her independence grew. Anytime you get people in wheelchairs together talking, there's just conversations that we have that we don't get to have around able-bodied people. It's just so nice. Aaron Fotheringham, also known as Wheels from Nitro Circus, will perform tricks. Utah Adaptive Alliance and Wasatch Adaptive Sports will share their programs. It absolutely opened up my eyes and my world to so many new opportunities with friends. Attendance is free thanks to the Challenged Athletes Foundation, and everyone is welcome here at Woodward Park City, Saturday from 4 o'clock until 8. We put a link on our website at ksltv.com. For KSL 5 News, I'm Jed Bowles.